Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, I'll show you the new Scarlet iOS update in 2025. A super easy way to install IPF files on your iPhone or iPad without using a computer, and most importantly, no revoke. Let's go step by step and see how to install apps using this latest Scarlet version. Okay, let's dive into it. First, open Safari on your iPhone or iPad. Then go to applejr.net. Then scroll down and hit Scarlet tab. Before installing Scarlet, you need to install the AppleJR DNS. Click Install button and click Allow. Then install it by going to Settings. Hit Profile Downloaded and install the DNS. Once DNS installed, go back to AppleJR website and download the Scarlet link. You can try Scarlet Link what you want or start from the first list first. You can install Scarlet simultaneously to see how it works on your device. Once it's installed, you'll see a message saying untrusted developer when you try to open it. Don't worry, that's normal. To fix that, go to Settings, General, VPN and Device Management, tap on the Scarlet developer name, and then tap Trust. After that, you can open Scarlet safely. The next step, you need to import the certificate into Scarlet. Open Scarlet, click on the side load tab, then tap and hold the button on the top right corner. It will show more options. Select Manage Cert, then tap Import Certificate. Now, you'll need to download the certificate from the AppleJIR website. Go back to AppleJIR.net scroll to the Certificate tab and download the latest certificate. After the file is downloaded, open your Files app, locate the certificate zip, and unzip it. Inside, you'll find two files, AP12 and a mobile provision file. Go back to Scarlet and import both files, then the mobile provision. When Scarlet asks for a password, type in applejr.net. Once imported successfully, Scarlet will automatically recognize the certificate and you're ready to sign your IPF files. Now, tap the plus button icon in Scarlet and select your IPF file, for example, eZine, Delta Emulator, Melon X, or any other app you want to install. Scarlet will sign the IPA using the imported certificate and start installing it directly to your home screen. If you see unable to install, you can try again install the IPF files. Once installation is done, open your app, it should launch perfectly. And that's how you use the new Scarlet iOS update to install IPF files easily, without revoke, and without a PC. If this video helped you, don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you don't miss the next certificate release from AppleJR. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one.